Very clever technology to measure the flow rate of water. It's great advantage, as I said, no moving parts. The second advantage is it's very precise. And we use the, the speed of sound to calculate the temperature. We measure very low flow rates, even down to a, a dropping water tap. So here we are at Electronica. We're at the stand of Sciosense, the uh, sensor chip and module maker. And I'm with Norbert Ray. And Norbert, Hello. delighted to see you. Hello, Tim. Well, my pleasure. Yeah. Wonderful. So um, you're going to talk to us today about an, an ultrasonic flow sensing module, aren't you? And uh, I think probably best just to start quickly by explaining ultrasonic sensing. What is that and why is it useful? Yeah, it's a very clever technology to measure the flow rate of water. It's already well established in the smart metering where the ultrasonic flow meters replace the classical rotational or turbine flow meters. The big advantage is there's no moving parts, so, so the endurance is much longer. The, the meters can run for 20 years. As 20 in, years in, in simple terms, in the traditional mechanical motors, they've got uh, whatever it is, blades or turbines that turbine. move around, exactly. and those can break or wear out or, 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 or become somehow corrupted. Exactly, exactly. So, mm. and with, our, with this ultrasonic technology, we use uh, what we do is we send an ultrasonic burst with the flow against the flow, and the time difference will be proportional to the flow rate and by this we can calculate the volume. The great advantage is, as I said, no moving parts. The second advantage is it's very precise, much more precise than a mechanical meter so we can measure very low flow rates even down to a uh, dropping water tap. So right. leakage detection will be also a where, big Where a traditional advantage. turbine has problems because the flow is not f powerful enough to, to turn the turbine. Exactly, yeah. exactly, mm -hmm. exactly. So, mm -hmm. so, and in this business of smart metering, we are already very well established with our front ends, with our ICs that make the complete um, measurement control. So it includes the drivers for the PH source, the pickup, the precision time measurement, and even a little CPU to do the flow calculation. The big advantage, this can be done at very low power consumption, which is important when you think of battery-driven systems like the smart meters in your home. Yeah. So and as we are already very well established in that market with our ICs, we got a lot of customers coming back to us saying, ah, we are no expert in ultrasound, could you offer a complete module? Yeah. And yeah. that's where we started. Yeah. Because, because it's a somewhat complex sort of system design if you're working with the, the raw chip, the raw sensor chip exactly. itself. Mm -hmm. um, there are multiple components to, to, to integrate and to make sure that they work properly together. So uh, the modular solution, that is all taken care of. It's all e Exactly, exactly. Mm -hmm. And of course, mm -hmm. we target those markets where the customers yeah, are really not used to ultrasonic technology. Yeah. And this is more yeah. like the consumer industrial market. So yeah. what we target are applications like water dispensers, water purifiers, uh, filter monitoring, but also then cooling systems, uh, uh, irrigation, uh, agricultural mm. applications, mm. everywhere where you want to measure the flow mm. and especially down to flow rates mm. to detect if there is a leakage on. Yeah, yeah. So those are the applications we And we're, we're talking here about um, many instances in which um, uh, the, uh, the, the manufacturer might not have previously used uh, implemented flow measurement at all. So for instance, um, in, in the case of filters, so typically filters would be replaced on a a regular schedule, so every six months or every year, mm. but because that is roughly when they when they become uh, uh, they get to their end of life. But with your product, then you can actually measure the actual flow through a filter, let's say. Exactly. Um, so there, it's, so the, it's about the volume. So yeah. it's not the time, but it's the volume that passed the yeah. filter when you have to exchange the filter. So mm. that's where the volume measurement comes in. And yeah. of course, it has to be maintenance-free, ideally, mm. run mm. forever, yeah. and at reasonable cost. And I think that's exactly a nice application okay. for our UFM Absolutely. module. Yeah. So um, so the module is that you're holding it in your hand exactly. there. So it's the, it's the UFM 01. Zero, oh one. Zero one. Okay, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And, and that is a, a complete unit, and the uh, and the output from that is is, is so you are the digital value, the flow rate or the volume, even the temperature can be output. It measures the temperature as well. Yes, yes, oh, yeah. We right, use okay. the, the speed of sound to calculate the temperature. Very clever. Right, so okay. you do so not it's need not a just sensor. Both flow and temperature all exactly. in, in in that one one chip and, and that one unit. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. exactly. And okay. the output as said is a UART or a one wire interface, so that. It, directly can connect it to your controller unit. Mm. So I think you can show us the, 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 the flow yes, meter sure, working sure. here. So, so you see what our nice orange juice tap yeah. here, mm -hmm. and the, the sensor is mounted at this spot here. It's yeah. just measuring the flow rate. Yeah. And so when I pick up some flow, then you will see that the display so the display is shows showing here the, the flow, flow rate, rate instantaneously. Of course, now it's zero, but you also see the volume. And you yeah. can imagine the, 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 the future systems coming up where you do not 
do this by hand. You just say, I want to have 100 milliliters yeah. of orange juice, and then the system will pull out 100 milliliters of orange Absolutely. juice. Absolutely, so perfect for uh, Siri or Alexa. Exactly. Okay, exactly. very good. And um, that's for your orange juice as well, is it? Yes. Okay. <laughs> very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. My pleasure.